all right welcome back to typical Tyrell tv so shelly and coach ronaldo walcott did an interview with the jamaica gleaner and he talked about her plans to eclipse the 100 meter national record that is being held by her compatriot ellen tam Sierra. but before i provide more details about that i'm just asking for two favors like the video and also subscribe to help to build the Tyrell community all right let's go so when question Shelly and chances of eclipsing the national record which is 10.44 this is what Renala Walcott had to say and I quote Definitely she can do it. Her last three races have suggested that she has been going marginally faster than before. She did 10.62 in the last race and that is 8, 800 of a second away from the national record. So I mean are we saying that somebody can't improve by 800 of a second? My answer would be yes. People can improve by 800 of a second and so I think it's definitely possible this season. End of quote. So hearing this from Shellyan's coach, this um, gives me more confidence that Shelly and Fraser Price can go 10-5. Right? I think she can definitely do this. Um, so far she has been having a brilliant season. She has won a record 5th world title. She has gone sub, sub 10-70 eight times in her career and six times in one season which is um unprecedented so um i think she has shown no signs of stopping so i think definitely she can go 10-5 on the 25th of august she will be up against ellen thompson Hera, which is the fastest woman alive over the 100 meter distance and also the national record holder she is also gonna be up against Sherika Jackson, who has become the sixth fastest woman alive in track and field history. So um, this will be the push for her to go 10-5 and for her to get a chance, a very good chance after world record, which is 10.49. But guys, you know, as you know, the comment section is for you. I want you guys to go in there and express um, your opinions on this. And also before you guys go, remember to like the video. And also subscribe to, to build the Tyrell community.